Hi everyone, in this lecture we are going to talk about HTML elements. Even though we have talked about HTML elements, I'm going to give you an example of how, how you can write HTML elements. Uh, and I do recommend, again, use VS Code because Emmet is in pre-installed. Emmet helps you write HTML elements very, very fast. So the first element, we are going to talk about this element later in the next lecture as well but I'm just going trying to create an HTML element so you know how it is created so to create an HTML element you just have to write the name of that element so what is the name of the element the name of the element is whatever comes inside the opening tag for any element so we have these two tags I'm just going to provide some space uh, this is an HTML element. So what is the where is the opening tag? This is the opening tag. What is the first word that is body? So this HTML element's name is body. And let's say you want to create an H1, which we talked about, right? You just write the name of it, and you can see it emit says emit abbreviation. It is going to create that. So just instead of typing all of this stuff, all of like this gr less than sign, greater than sign, then less than sign, greater than sign, you can just go ahead and write H1, and it is and hit enter. It is going to create that element for you. And within whatever comes within the content, within the opening tag and the closing tag, is going to be the content that is going to be shown on the web page. So I'm going to say Python boot camp. When you hit save, it says Python boot camp right here. So you can see how cool this is, how you can work with this. So again, opening tag, content, closing tag, and uh, any element in the HTML, it could be a parent. And any element in HTML, it could become a child. When an element is within another element, the uh, con the containing element is the parent, and the contained element is the child. So let's just take this body into account, into example. So you can see that we have our H1, and you can see this is indented. So HTML in this way works in the same way as Python. It doesn't have any other, like, semicolon or any other thing when you just hit enter it is going to indent it for you if it is not indented it means that this h1 does not belong to this body so in this sense html and python are the same so you have this body element within the body element you have h1 h1 is the child body is the parent this is the containing element this is the contained element that's it for this lecture see you in the next one